Hello YouTube, today I'm in Kerbal Space Program and in this video we're going to start a new save file. This is uh, yeah, a new save that I'm going to use from now on to do most of my KSP videos. You know, all the little random videos that I do on diff me doing different things in the game. And hopefully I'll talk a bit about what I'm doing and talk a bit about other stuff as well. We'll see. Um, so this is going to be like the save file that I do all my standard videos on. Then hopefully I'll be able to do um, other videos like mod, you know, previews and things on another save file, that kind of thing. Or even in another install of the game to you know do other things that aren't quite so that aren't just like a standard video basically anyway uh, the, to start off the first um, the first video I thought you know why not start off a space station as well so I live streamed this all again over at well actually no I live streamed this on YouTube just to see what would happen but usually I'll live stream over at Twitch because that did work better YouTube it still isn't very good for streaming it's a bit of a pain to do and not really worth the effort so uh, yeah I think I'm still going to keep live streaming over at Twitch and yeah I'm starting off a new save file and as you can see we're using some of the Li uh, larger parts which actually mean that you can get incredibly low part count rockets which will do quite good stuff I mean we're taking a large section of a space station all the way up into well space and uh, yeah we're going to use that as the sort of base of the station it's basically a cupola module which is going to give us some nice visuals of Kerbin as we go around uh, with some basically Mark 1 fuselages with docking ports between them and a bit of power and RCS storage as well and a couple of small solar panels I think so basically it's the sort of base of the space station and you see here I actually tried to turn and then went all the way around yeah didn't didn't mean that it just kind of happened but you know we managed to recover okay we're kind of high enough up that the atmosphere isn't really causing that much drag so it wasn't too big a deal um, you can actually recover from those apparently so you know it worked fine we have plenty of fuel and pen plenty of uh, thrust from this engine so it wasn't the most efficient ascent but it still worked and yeah we're going to try and get this into a low orbit maybe 80 kilometers or so because uh, if we do that then hopefully we should be able to get up to it with single stage to orbit planes which is always fun I guess um, so yeah that's what I'm going to do uh, sometime soon hopefully well actually I've already done it but you don't know that yet so pretend I didn't tell you anyway and uh, now we're just coasting up to the apoapsis nothing too special really again this is just <laughs> a sort of introductory video for this now I'm gonna stop putting the intro into the videos just because it was a waste of five seconds and it was just some noise but the outro I'm gonna keep because that has links to all the social stuff in it and I may as well put it there because it sounds cool so yeah I'm gonna keep doing that but uh, I kind of didn't really see the point in the little, well, it wasn't even an intro anymore. Um, and I may as well get straight into the video. So I'm going to do that. That's that's going to be a thing from now on. And yeah, that's, that's how things are going to go. I'm going to try and keep things sort of simple and to the point. But yeah, over these next sort of three months, I'm going to try and release videos as often as possible, basically. So hopefully there'll be loads of content for you guys. I'm still it's difficult because I have to think of things to talk about and the difficulty with recording lots of videos is a the fact that you've got to sit and record for quite a lot of time but mostly actually because you've got to think of ideas to talk about so this one's easy because I'm just talking about how I'm making a new series and how I'm gonna have a lot more free time but you know the gameplay isn't generally enough to talk about I could either I'd, I'd have to record a lot more gameplay and speed it up so there's a lot more in a shorter space of time so that the stuff that's on screen is enough to make the video entertaining if I just talk about it but I'm not going to do that because that's kind of a waste of time basically so I'm going to try if I can to think of interesting things to talk about which are hopefully somewhat related to what's in the video so if you have any ideas leave them in the comments below that's always useful and yeah we're not even far off finished now, we're just circularizing the orbit to be honest. There's not really that much more to it. We're nearly done already. Um, and then we've still got quite a lot of fuel in this stage, but unfortunately we can't really get rid of it because it's sort of, you know, not really controllable. So all we're going to do now is point this part so that it's pointing sort of north-south because then it's easier to dock to and stuff. And I actually end up pointing it the other way around. 
you'll see. Yep, there we go. But there we go, we've got a couple of solar panels as well. And hopefully we'll be able to launch up some more modules to this, maybe a crew module and some power storage and generation. And then that'll be sort of set up for now. And then we can go and explore this solar system a lot more. Maybe put some bases on, some planets, that kind of thing. And yeah, we'll see what we can do. So anyway guys, thanks for watching the video. Hope you liked it, and if you did, then give it a thumbs up or a favourite. If you have any suggestions or questions, as I said before, leave a comment down below. And as always, thanks for watching, and have a nice day.